we're getting some remarkable footage and photos of some pretty strange looking Bigfoot. We got to sift through them, but we've seen ones that are getting. Yes. Wait a minute. Clarify that. Getting. Well, we've we've ha- been. We've had. We we will continue to have the best footage on the internet, well, and there's a reason for that. And let me clarify that for you. We did get a platinum squatch award. Yeah, that's true. That's true. But look, recognizing the channel for giving uh, the viewers the best. Yeah, well, they're the best of everything, the best footage and the best uh, commentary as Bringing well. Bringing to you things that have never been talked about before. I understand that, but I'm just saying we're getting some stuff that's quite remarkable we haven't posted yet, and I, I want people Wait, to stay Why are you holding back? Well, we got to post what we have. I don't think this South Carolina footage is spectacular. I think the scenery is very beautiful here. But we're not trying to show the scenery. We're trying to show Bigfoot. But Bigfoot is hidden in this. Now, should this... I'm awfully glad that this isn't the female Bigfoot because I would want to see some, you know, some knockers. And well, some we ass do. On we this. do have that, and we're and we're make we're making sure that trackers track down female Bigfoot. Now, you had said you were saying, how do you tell whether it's a female Bigfoot or, or not? Because it's got big breasts, yeah. Now and a shapely derriere. And now, is that the only thing that you can determine with it? You know, or how how would you know beyond that? Is I don't it, think you can see painted lips or you know earrings or anything. Oh, I thought you were talking about sneaking up on a female bigfoot when it was sleeping or something in a previous episode. Ooh, I would you wouldn't never want to, do, want to sneak up on a female. No, that's bigfoot. what I'm saying. You shouldn't do that. So, um, oh, you mean to see if I could see between its? I, I don't know what you were talking about. I'm just saying that that should never it should, it should never come. That's an invasion of bigfoot privacy, and especially what, what privacy do they have? I don't think they have any privacy. We're bringing photo upon photo. Photo upon video upon video, and well, there's you, privacy. Well, uh, but okay. Well, I mean, when you you've talked over and over about uh, about the uh, person for you, Bigfoot. Don't now, you think? Do you think we're infringing on personhood? Yeah. Well, if you do that, that you are because don't. So you're admitting to infringing on personhood for Bigfoot. Don't you? You think, think we're going to be in trouble? We're going to get a lawsuit. Something's going to happen. Maybe because, yeah, maybe down the road. Have that, we crossed the line? Don't you think there's a difference between snapping a photo of, let's say, a woman at a beach? And then uh, uh, spread eagle or not spread eagle? No, uh, on a nude beach no, or on a clothed no, I'm not, beach? No, I'm not talking about a nude beach. I'm just saying, talk, uh, taking a photo of a woman in a park or or on a street or something. If you're in public, and you're, then and then the next step, what you're talking about you're is open taking, game. You're, no, you're saying taking pictures of a female Bigfoot when it's sleeping. Well, you certainly can't take that a camera, is going too a far. Hidden camera that is going too far. A public restroom for women, but yeah. if they're on the beach with no clothes, what the? I mean, come on. Okay, well okay. they're. Exp- Wait themselves. until Bigfoot gets personhood. There's a lot of lawyers working on this. Well, I think we need to we need to get all the footage we can get now because what are we going to face when personhood comes? Okay, well then, do you think the law? You don't think the law is going to be retroactive then? Well, you better hope not. 